Hey, you guys, how's it going out there in Facebook world? Hope you guys are all doing okay. I um, feel like I picked poor Peggy up on the side of the road and I dropped her off. And um, <laughs> I've been suffering over here and I know I am not the only one at all at, by any stretch of the imagination. So I am really, truly praying over every single soul that um, is reached or touched or hears this video because man the, the suffering around us is getting intense right am i wrong or am i right Woo! it cannot possibly just be me and i'm certainly the last one to ever think that something is just me um i feel like a lot of times i'm i'm super blessed so i feel like once the, when the suffering gets to me i feel like it's all around me <laughs> praying 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 over you guys so we just got um I just got done watching a uh, a broadcast from Hey Sarah from um, our home office, and it was we have simulcast. So our spring simulcast is this Saturday, um, and I really just want to take a second to talk about finding your tribe of people. I mean, not only during the times when. Um, during celebration and during times of elation and times of super, um, you know, s s when everything's going great, um, I really think it's important that you find people that will pray with you and that will come, I have no idea what that was, but that will come, um, like, <laughs> that's why I feel like the, um, some of our Mary and Martha sisters have literally laid on the floor with me. <laughs> Um, I just recently went through COVID and I'm still, I still feel it. I don't feel great still to this minute, <laughs> but we just got through with that, um, with a leaders simulcast. So my name is Kathleen, you guys, I'm coming to you from Charleston, South Carolina, and it is, um, today we have, it, it, I think it's 57 degrees outside. So you're on my back patio office. Welcome to my back patio office. Um, but it's about 57 degrees out here, but t they've closed schools for tomorrow um, now because of severe weather. So we're still intrigued by what that means for um, what that means for Charleston. And I'm not 100% convinced that it wasn't a staffing shortage, to be perfectly honest. <laughs> my kids, um, my high I have a 13 year old and a 14 year old. My high schooler, her school got closed. Um, last week so her school's been closed for um a few days now and now the my middle schooler her her school got closed tomorrow too and they said it's because of severe weather um it is drizzly if you can hear that so i apologize the wild things are in there and you can probably hear them too and it is total it's 11 o'clock at night here ish um so not that, I, not that i have a clock but it's 11 o'clock at night and my wild things are still going strong in there um but i really feel like if i didn't have mary and Mar my mary and martha sisterhood um a lot of people would not have um i would not have been fortified as much as i was so it is really awesome to be part of this community i mean amazing um so again um finding your tribe of people of like-minded people is just such an amazing thing um not only to serve you but for to serve for you to serve them as well it's really incredible um it's really given me a value and a purpose that i really did not know um was there before if you have never like this i love these encouragement boxes too by the way i've never seen um if it's never I, I know I've only popped on once, but I feel like I've known Peggy for a really long time. Um, but this, these are, this is called an encouragement box for Mary and Martha. And this one kind of hunted me down and it wanted to come to my house. Um, I won it. I won it three times. I rejected it twice. And then finally, um, they just looked at my address. But I always, um, one of these, one, a white one called the Love is Kind Promise Box, which is on the discontinued um, list for right now on the discontinued sale it's called the love is kind and it, that i won that one in um in april of, and it sits by our front door and really was what um rem, what brought to light that well the the word of god was totally missing in our house it'd be just the time of um 
it, it really caught up, caught up to us. Um, the online church and piping in um, the word of God had really caught up to us. So um, here's an encouragement card that I'm going to pull for us tonight. It says, when God made you, he used the same creative flair that set the galaxies in the heavens, put the colors in the rainbow, made the hummingbird fly, and the nightingale sing. No wonder you're amazing. So the rule is when you pull a card from one of these boxes, you have to read it out loud because you assume that someone needs to hear it. And usually that person is me <laughs> in our household. Um, but you actually usually it moves my 13 and 14 year old too. Um, so who doesn't need to hear that tonight? When God made you, he used the same creative flair that set the galaxies in the heavens, put the colors in the rainbow, it made the hummingbird fly, and the nightingale sing. No wonder you're amazing. That is awesome. I'll, I'll be taking a picture of that and putting it in my own, um, my own um, gathering group there. Uh, but... So simulcast again, um, you can go as Peggy's guest for $10 and really experience, um, well, you get a new, you, you get to be the first one to see um, the new products that are coming out in the spring. And I'm telling you, we just got a glimpse tonight and they are awesome, awesome, awesome. And you won't want to miss those, but you get to be the first one. So for 10 bucks, you can register as Peggy's guest and be eligible. They're giving away um, $2,000 worth of Mary and Martha products. And Mary Martha is super generous already with what they give away. I'm telling you, I can't imagine um, what giveaways are going down um, that day. But if you want to really see what the Mary Martha community is all about, definitely um, get with Peggy and register as a guest of hers um, for 10 bucks, And get to be a part of our community for a day and kind of test the waters and see how um, amazing um, the fellowship is and the praise and worship. Um, we just had a leader night again tonight and it, they have worship, fellowship, training. Um, they're just so succinct and amazing. They've done a great job of, um, wrapping up all they want to wrap up in one, um, in, in a two hour presentation. And really they got, um, recognition, <laughs> praise and worship training and a, a little product reveal in that two hour time. It was really awesome. Um, also I want to show you, um, these went on sale. These perpetual calendars went on sale, um, in right before Christmas. And when I, I didn't really understand the value of it, actually, to be honest, when I first saw them and I ordered, I ordered several for, um, my grandmother has been um, in a terrible and terrible health. Um, she turned 88 on December 10th. Um, but she has been suffering, so she's suffering hard. Um, and her, she was in a rehab facility, in and out of a rehab facility for like a year and a half. And she, when the last time she left the rehab facility, she said, "This is the last time I'm leaving this rehab facility." And um, since then we've been, um, trying to help her cope, trying to help her, um, help her along. And, um, she actually had to, she was at her own home living with her, her daughter lived with her and now her, her daughter's in the ICU, um, suffering from COVID and it's not looking great either. So prayers over that whole situation. Here comes the rain. Um, but, uh, so when um when my grandmother deemed that it was the last time that she would be checking out this rehab facility we had a fundraiser um she won a what what she won a paparazzi cuff bracelet a bingo and she thought it was the most amazing thing there's no way i was going to tell her it was only five bucks because the way she talked about it was like it was like, like princess dies sapphire i mean it was just the best thing in the world for her and um we just really needed a way to leave some joy behind us at that rehab facility um because it was a long-term care and a rehab facility so we find we did need to find a way to leave some joy behind there so we had a fundraiser and i was able to um raise funds for these perpetual calendars and when it, i didn't realize until i got one from um both my daughters but 
I wish I had gotten one for my nieces and my nephews. And I wish I had got one for everyone because they're an amazing idea. Um, so they they stand up on their own and they have their, they stand up on they're just a desktop calendar, but they don't have the year on it. So um, she got to write on the ones we um, we gave away like ten. Um, we gave I think it was ten, ten or twelve. Um, to the rehab facility because they were just great ideas. They're just a super great idea. Um, and then when once I got them in my hands, I was like, oh, I wish I would have gotten one of these for um, my nieces, and my nephews, like the people who I want to remember um, important dates because they're perpetual calendars. They don't have the year on them. They just have the date on them. Um, so this one is the God's Got It, Tony Evans. And um, it says, God's got it, so you can grow. Insisting on living in your past will kill your future. It's a new year. Move on. So every day it has an inspirational message on it. And um, so now I'm so glad to get the opportunity to be able to order them, um, order my nieces and nephews some more. Because um, you can write down your mom and dad's um, birthdays. You can write down your aunt and uncle's anniversary. You can write down every important date, um, memorial dates. I just unfortunately lost a 39-year-old friend. Um, so, and it was a few, um, it, unfortunately, a few weeks before her, her 40th birthday. And um, so those dates that are important to you, you can write down and always have them perpetually, forever. So I think that's a really great idea, um, especially to give your younger, the younger people and, um, just makes them think, think thoughts, <laughs> makes them a little more thoughtful about, um, days passing by into the future. Um, so that, these are really, really, really great. And there's a ton of variety in them. Um, this one is the God's Got It by Tony Evans. And I really like this one for my 14 year old. And then this one is Jesus Calling. And these are, this Jesus Calling is large theory. This is large print. So you can see it across the room. And again, my grandmother got to write um, from Barbara Williams on the, she got to write it. Um, so it kind of left a little, she definitely smiled the whole time. She was writing from, the, into the from category there. Yeah. But these are large prints. So you can see, um, Seek my face and you will find more than you ever dreamed possible. Let me displace worry at the center of your being. How delightful is that? Um, again, though, you could certainly write, um, you could pencil yourself in for, like if you were going to give this to a friend, pencil yourself in for lunch dates every Thursday, the third Thursday of every month. You and I are going to have coffee, meet you at, um, meet you at Blank Cafe at 2.30. <laughs> And you could pencil yourself in for coffee dates, and you could write in all the important dates. Um, or it would be really cute for um, a wife to give their husband, like, we, this is the day we met, this is where, so, because they have no, it has no year on it. You could use this forever. You never need another calendar again. So I think these are really great, and I was really, I'm really, really, really thankful for the opportunity Um I feel like Mary and Martha can read my mind or they watch my um, Facebook lives. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, I wish I'd gotten more. Now that I understand, it's in my hand. But these are really, these really are great, great um, product for nine dollars, nine dollars, nine whole dollars. Um, you can have years of worth and use out of this, and you can um, mark special dates in the calendar there and remember the entire catalog is buy one get one half off right now so um, now that the really now that the, the um, January clearance sale is over it opens up even more opportunities for you to put together really great savings packages and um, you know, unfortunately manufacturing prices are going up all over the place and it's nothing um, Mary and Martha can truly do about it and so there, you know, the prices are going up a few dollars, a few dollars for some things and substantially for some things. So right now is buy one, get one half off of, um, a lot of the, a lot of these items are just, it's just an unbeatable deal. So I hope you guys, um, reach out, let me know if there's anything I can help you do or help you with. 
Any questions you have for Peggy, she'll be glad to answer as well. I'm sorry, my phone number stopped. Um, and I um, am praying a oh, peace over every single soul again that's watching. I mean, it. Thank God. Thank you, God. Just thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, um, for His hope. <laughs> thank you for His faithfulness. Thank Him for His um, uh, His provision. For our lives thank you lord for just being there um thank you lord for aligning me with mary and martha for such a time i've never felt so spiritually um fortified as i do right now and as crazy as that sounds because uh it really is burning <laughs> the walls are burning on all sides of me currently and um i can still I can still see the hope and still find the purpose, um, especially now more than ever to spread hope and encouragement. And God bless you, Peggy, for helping us do the same. So if there's any questions you guys have about anything, please do let me know. Again, I wish if I, um, I'm so glad they brought these back because I got eight more of them. <laughs> Excuse me. I have eight more coming now. They just make terrific gifts, too. They make terrific gifts. Very thoughtful gifts, too, where you can um, you can make it very personalized and then use them year after year. So I think it's a really cool idea. Um, but I hope um, everyone is doing well again, you guys. And I am going to say a quick prayer over all of us and um, bid you a good night. So, dear Heavenly Father, we are so thankful that you have allowed us one more day on this earth, Lord. We thank you for um, providing all that we'll ever need, Lord. Thank you for providing us with um, your hope, your word, your encouragement, Lord. We know you've seen every day, uh, every minute that we'll live. We know you've seen every round, every corner. And Lord, our total faith and our total trust is in you. Heavenly Father, to um, sustain us and keep us whole. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen. Good night, you guys. Thank you. Bye.